Hello my friends and happy Saturday. I hope that you were able to sleep in just a little bit or a lot bit, I don't know. But for me, I wake up super, super early. So I just do that. It's not because I have anything really important to do first thing in the morning. It's just that's what time God wakes me up every day, really early in the day. So whatever time you press play on the other side of this screen, please know that I am already thinking of you. I have already prayed over you and I've already prepared this lesson for you. I love this time we are able to spend together. I love it. I cherish it. I look forward to it. So let's go ahead and jump in, okay? Now, for today, we the, the title of our devotion is um, See God's Family Growing. And that is so exciting. I When I think of that title right there, See God's Family Growing, I think of baptisms. Because that's when our family gets a little bit bigger and a little bit bigger and a little bit bigger. Anytime there's a baptism, I get a new brother or sister. And I love that too. Okay, guys, so we are going to be jumping around to several different places in our scripture reading for today. So because we are, I'm going to put all of those verses right here so that when you get your Bible out, you know where I'm going to be going and where I'm going to be reading from, okay? So we are going to start off in Luke 1, verse 57. It says, Now the time came for Elizabeth to give birth, and she bore a son. She had a son. And they said to her, None of your relatives is called by this name. And they made signs to his father, inquiring that he, what he wanted him to be called. And he asked for a writing tablet and wrote, His name is John. And they all wondered. And his father Zechariah was filled with the Holy Spirit and prophesied, saying, Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, for he has visited and redeemed his people. Praise Jesus. Okay, our poem for today says, Today I learned that John was born. His birth was special too. John points the way to Jesus, just as God said he would do. Elizabeth's husband, Zachariah, was very excited the day his son was born. At first, he did not believe he would be a father, even though the angel had shared God's promise. Zachariah should have been the first to believe. He was a priest in the temple, you see, like a pastor. Because he doubted the promise, God had silenced Zachariah until his baby John was born. Now Zachariah though, we heard it, didn't we? Yes, we heard Zachariah is singing too. He sings because God's promises do come true. He sings because baby John points us in the way to see the Savior. Let's pray. Lord, when John grew up, he led other people to Jesus. Give us the words to say that lead others to you too. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. Amen. All right, guys, I'll see you tomorrow. Have a great Saturday.